Uh, so JVT. It is, it's kind of a sensitive topic, and a lot of people say a lot of things. So I was like, what is some way I can be memorable? So I was like, I'll just bring a guitar and wear tiger stripes. So um, just trying to have fun. Cause Absolutely. Last week, uh, Leah Thomas, you know, I'm sure you've heard the news, swimmer for Penn. Uh, biological male, but she identifies as a woman. She won the NCAA championship, and um, Emma Wyant, she's a biological female, she came in second. And I just wanted to talk about the broader issue about, you know, transgender rights and saving women's sports, and I just thought it would be kind of a fun, lighthearted way to do kind of a, a fun parody song about it, uh, about the Backstreet Boys. So, to the tune of I Want It That Way. So, it's... <laughs> I won't be silent cause I'm Moayan got robbed of first place. Why did girl sports go away? I could not believe my eyes cause South Park is real life. Let the girls play. Why do girls oh, oh, sports go no, no. away? Tell me why hate hey. and Brian is a crime, I assume. Hey. Unless it's in the pen girls locker room. I never want to hear you say, why do girls sports go away? But please, just don't act surprised. When girls sports are all guys, that's how it stays. Why girls sports go away? What if Shaq went to the WNBA? He would score 850 points a game. Even Caitlyn Jenner thinks it's insane. Please don't let girls sports go away. Now, I know that just trying to be funny, but um, I think we can advance tr transgender rights and have compassion for them, but also preserve women's sports. It's something I'm passionate about, and I think you'll remember this because you've never heard a Backstreet Boys parody in a city council. I don't want to go over my time, but thank you very much. Thank you. We, if we could not interrupt each other, that'd be great. Okay. Next, next speaker is, uh, I'm going to get it right. I always mess this up. Eva? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Eva Greco. You come here and I, and I want to.